Dude's yard. Gonna pick up uh, Megan's boat this morning, take it to Extreme Motorsports, and move on to the next step. Start building the cage here. A pillars, B pillars, C pillars. Build the cage right here. So we can uh, start making it look like the mojo book. Something I do when I have the cord, I put the cord right through this handle right here. What that does is no matter what the trailer's doing, no matter what the trailer's doing, the cord always stays over the center of the ball. So no matter where the trailer goes, the cord's not going to get yanked or hung up on something or, you know, just become a problem. For now, it's pivoting right with the ball. A little trailer tip for you. figure out all these angles of all this stuff to match it to the other boat and what we did is we got this uh, raising rod here and we bent it so it's exactly in line with the B pillar and it's exactly in the line with the gunnel of the boat so that we can take this to Wyatt and actually match this angle up exactly we line up with this pipe which it does and perfectly line up with and it does so that's our C pillar jig right there I made a, uh, a drawing of all of this for Wyatt got the A pillar B pillar C pillar A pillar B pillars C pillar the distance between them we've got the angles on the pieces I just made the distance between them the angle back the height so in theory we should be able to build all of this pretty much identical to this boat. I was debating round or oval. Yeah, I'm almost thinking it needs to be just like a quarter, quarter just enough for the the bead and then the pipe to sit on here. Yeah, and then here there's no body line, so whatever we see here, and I, I'm not gonna mark this because of, we don't know exactly where it's going yeah. yet. That one was capped and then it was done seamless, so it's like it fell into Right, the, right. So. But, um, in here, it's just center of this, um, that line. I think it was a quarter inch in or something. And I'll take pictures of all this so you have something to reference. But So we have the window in place here. And I believe the Mojo window was seven inches from here. So we're gonna have to bring this up like a two by four or something. It needs to lean back just a little bit. So is the center higher or the lower? The lower than the two outer edges. Yeah, so we need to tip it back just a tiny bit. It doesn't take much. 
Right. Yep. And then we pick up the angle of the window. And I'm okay. We can move forward. We don't have to match this because this this dash, the other dash was back. Do you yeah, that's think pretty good right there. It would be beneficial to just do. A I do. I just, I think we'd be better off just to do a straight run. Right. I I think this and doesn't. And land look it here, good. and then let him just do the body work to to fill this and come. I feel like he would be able to float. He could. Yeah. Falling right, that angle, right. float off of that. Can we stick a piece of pipe there? Okay. So we're. You haven't moved, right? Nope. Four, eight, four, five. I think we could call it four, nine. Go up just a tiny bit. Do what? Yep, up just a tiny bit. Right there, four, nine, oh. Okay. Now, down, 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 right, right there. Four, nine, it's really sensitive, huh? So four, nine, zero. I like the, two, I like the so. straight approach way better. Pull it out a little bit. Go to where's four nine zero? How do we? Oh, we're in the center of the window, so we got to go. We have center. to go like outside the window. Yeah, outside the window. So wanna... if we're four nine zero here, we are four nine two. Then out here we're going to be five. Call it fifty three. Yeah, fifty three. Okay, so that'll be our angle fifty three. I like the straight shot. We're good. Five inch. So let's write that. We got a sharpie. Let's write it here. We got our, our uh, diagram done, We've gone over it with Wyatt. We've got our C pillar template wire built. We've got our B pillar template wire built. We've laid the window out. We know where it's going. We have our angles. We know where everything's going. Now it's up to Wyatt to do something. Work my magic. Just enough overkill. <laughs>